What up, people? Here we are, another Academy game. Liverpool hosting United. Two big teams in this league, two quality teams in this league, and two teams with a lot of high potential players. Let's go over Liverpool briefly. They're going to run a 4-3-3 false nine. Manager Chris has got some good guys in this lineup. You got Van der Laar, the superstar, playing center forward, flanking him. Danny Barry, superstar. On the other side, you've got Joshua Wood. There's rumors that Wood may be leaving the club, but also rumors that Wood may be taking over that right wing spot long term. In the middle, the Hungarian Horvath. You got the captain, Briscoe. You got the bald-headed Ben Khan, another big primetime player. Your back line with some really high potential players, Lawson, Fanelli, Corey, Bamber, and LaCassie. And in goal, you got Robbie Pollock. So let's go over here quickly and look at the United team. Look at this team, guys. At top, Oliver Henry, big-time primetime scorer. You got Big Barwick over here. You got Connor Ure. In the middle, you got Hewitt, the red-headed captain, Jake Ellis, who scored in the first game. You got John Miller. And in the back, Welsh Perry, Gareth Gibson, Jake's little brother, Brandon Anthony. And on the right, Connor James, a.k.a. Connor Burbage Jr. In the back, we all know who the keeper is, Miss Hart. Going to be trying to do what she can to keep the balls out of the back of the net. So this is a big matchup. Huge matchup here to start things off today in a little bit of a friendly. Sometimes I hate to play these big matchups early like this in a friendly, but I also think it's exciting to get things moving in the right direction with two big teams with a lot of quality players. Now, as you know, both of these teams have new managers. Well, not one of them. One of them's got Mort Snurd. Everybody knows Mort Snurd, the most annoying manager on the face of the planet. But you didn't hear that from me. So let's get over here with Liverpool playing host to our Red Devils in Manchester United. We'll go with the home unis and the away unis. And let's get this thing started. So manager Chris recently took over Liverpool. He's done a lot of things with that club already. And then Mort Snurd, who took Sligo to the Irish Academy Cup, taking over at United. Looks like we're going to have a foggy day here, foggy night. Stadium looks beautiful. Lots of fans here tonight. Anfield is rocking. We're bouncing. We're about to get this thing started here. Thank you, Robbie Pollock in goal. And the Reds are going to start out with the ball. Ben Kahn over to Briscoe. Briscoe dumps it down to the aforementioned Joshua Wood. Briscoe promptly turns it over and back come the Red Devils. Miller dumping it down to Barwick, who's got a lot of space here. Looks like he's got everybody beat. This could be a breakaway. He's not that fast, but he takes a shot anyway and just misses. The closer he got to the net, the lower the angle was. He had a guy cutting in. Not sure why he didn't give it up, but he thought he had space. United with a big opportunity to start this game off in the first three minutes. Barwick's not the fastest guy. He's definitely strong. If he had a little bit more pace there, he would have been in well all alone. But needless to say, the game remains 0-0. But United maintains possession here at midfield. Miller with the ball, dropping it back to Jake's little brother. And here we go. Connor James making some nifty moves, dumps it off to Uri. Uri back. Nice. Uri couldn't get much on that. 85 Connors in the league. Nice little move there by Hewitt, who is not a Connor, but is a Cameron. Nice dump in again to another Connor. Connor looking for a cross. There it is. Nice defense there. 
by Liverpool to get that ball out. And Briscoe coming back the other way for the Reds. Tom Lawson up top. Horvath switches it down to Briscoe. And the Red Devils try for a long pass here. Which ends up in a turnover. And United come back the other way with Miller dropping it off to Henry. Well, actually, it was Hewitt to Henry. Now to Henry. Back to Hewitt. Back to Henry. It's like a little game of catch. Nice dump in, but not nothing. there's nothing there. Nice clearance there by the Liverpool defense. Khan's looking to make a run. Drops it off to Barry. Barry was a huge talent at Derry. Came in after a few games. Scored a ton of goals. High potential guy. Henry and United here. Jake Ellis with the ball. Seems like there's a lot of space in this game early. Welsh Perry drops it off to the redheaded Ellis. Henry, the big shot by Hewitt from way outside the box. He lets it fly. Easy save. Kid's got a cannon. Look at that. Just put it right on net. Nice save. Hewitt puts it in the box. Gibson's coming up. Decides to take a shot. Another big save. Gareth Gibson said, where's my shot? Right on goal. Nice save by Pollock. Red Devils are heating up here. Putting the pressure on. Hewitt back in the box. Same play here. Gibson passes it at Barrett. I thought Gibson was going to lace another one towards the net. Pollock's going to try to slow things up here. Back comes Hewitt into the box. He doesn't have much. Dumps it down to Barwick. Back to Ellis. Now Ellis is in the box. Dumps it down to Barwick. I think the flag was up, and there it is, offsides. Barwick was a little too antsy to get there and took a little too long for Ellis to get him the ball. Offsides. And back it comes the other way. Bamber out of the backfield. Rips it towards midfield. Back comes United. As you can see here, four shots for United, none for Liverpool in the last 15 minutes. The Reds have been on their back foot most of this game. Connor Uri breaking in. Pulls it back, looking into the box, dumps it in. Not a great cross there. Pollock easily eats that ball up. As we enter the 27th minute here at Anfield. Nice play by Barwick there. Good effort. Ben Kahn, haven't heard his name much. Just waiting to see him run somebody over. Switches it all the way up to Barry. Barry taps it off to Horvath. Lawson making a run here at the top of the screen with his sweet bandana. Horvath looking to drop one in. Nice defense there by Connor James and clears it out. Nice control there. Lawson gives it to Barry. Barry back. Barry's getting a lot of touches here, as is Lawson. Loose ball here in the box, controlled by United. Liverpool got, gets it back. Con back to Barry. Back to Con. Con this is it. Passes it into Briscoe. Briscoe takes a shot. How did he miss that? The general. The captain. Shankaroo. Nothing but net available. And Briscoe. Disgusted. First time we're going to call her name, but Hart looking to play the ball out of the box. Dumps it down. Nice leg. 
Reds have possession. Warwick again here finding some space. Up to Henry. In the last Man United game, Barwick had tons of space on the wings. And you can see he's finding more and more space on this game too. Nice play by Bamber. Finelli pallies it out to Lawson. Lots of space on the wings here. You can tell each team is really trying to spread the pitch a little bit. Make this game play wide. Khan here approaching midfield. Dumps it in towards Wood. Wood controls it back to Vandalar. Nice play here between these two. Wood playing well. Nice cross by Wood. Nice cross by Wood. Nobody home. This Wood kid's playing pretty well. I wouldn't be shocked to see manager Dornbosch try to keep him at this winger position, even though he's naturally a cam. He's young enough to be able to switch positions here. Barwick with a terrible pass out of bounds. But I know that Wood has a desire, from what I've read, to stay at Liverpool. He's a big fan of the Reds. Not sure who that was to, but Hewitt's there waiting for that errant pass. LSU United moving up the pitch here. Henry was expecting Uri to break on that ball, but Connor just sat there. And Liverpool bamber down to Lacassie. Indicated the passing in, by the Reds here is, leaves much to be desired. Some terrible passing here. Dumps it in. Henry can't get to it. Played back to Pollock. And Pollock looks content to try to get this whistle to head on into the locker room. But he turns it over here. Connor Uri back into Henry. Henry in the box. Dumps it over to Hewitt. Hewitt's got some space here. He's going to take a shot. Another save by Pollock. Pollock's wondering what's going on here. Another great look by Hewitt. Just again, too many shots right at the keeper as opposed to on either side. But that's going to force another corner here. Miller on the corner, dumps it into the box. Nice clearance. Looked like Finelli cleared that ball out. And as we hear the whistle, we head into halftime. Relatively quiet game as the score dictates. But lots of opportunities here for United. They just haven't been able to find the back of the net. As I said, six shots on target out of seven shots. But all, most of them are right at Pollock. Looks like Briscoe didn't need his Wheaties. He's already in the yellow. He looks a little tired. You can tell Liverpool's been pressed a lot in this game. They're feeling a little fatigued. They need to drink some Gatorade. Maybe have some Mickey D's. Get some energy. Get back out here in the second half. So here we go. United with the ball. 20 bucks says Jake ate some Mickey D's and some ice cream before this game started. It's what I've heard is his go-to meal before the game. Miller turns the ball over here. Back come the Reds. Ben Kahn with the ball. We're anxiously awaiting the release of the August Players of the Month. It'll be interesting to see if Ben Kahn is selected based on his big goal for Sligo in that Academy Cup final. But there were a lot of great players in midfield, so we'll have to see who ends up with those awards. Lacassie plays it out to Briscoe. Briscoe's got some space here heading towards midfield. Danny Barry with the ball. Horvath back to Lawson. Lawson dumps it in. Turns the ball over. Uri with the dangerous pass back, which gets cleared out. 
And the Reds maintain possession again. Danny Barry back heels it to Horvath. Horvath's got some room here. Vanderlaar has been a quiet player in this game. But he's the kind of guy that may not be seen much in a game up until the waning seconds, and then bang, he puts one in. Reds fans would love that. And here comes United. Or he's got a little bit of space, dumps it back to Hewitt. Hewitt to Miller. Back to Hewitt. Just on the outside of the box here. He looks like he's trying for a cross, but they're closing him down. Puts one in the box anyway. Cleared out what looked to be Finelli with a nice clearance. And back come the Reds. Vandalar with the ball. He's got good pace here, but he's getting hawked down. We don't start seeing some action here for the Reds soon. I'm going to fall asleep announcing this game. Ben Kahn. Vandalar down. Nice pass to Barry. Barry looks for a cross, but it gets blocked. Still maintains control. Throws one in the box. Easy clearance. Nice ball out to Henry. United look for a break. Barwick. Like I said, not the fastest of strikers. But he's got a room. It looked like he might have been off. No call. No flag. Back come the Reds. Lacassi down to Briscoe. Reds fans are hoping that Lacassi blossoms into a stellar right back. He's got all the potential in the world. Not a good cross there. Pretty much shank a rank that one right out of bounds. Miss Hart's going to play the ball out the back. Boots it towards midfield. United with the ball. Connor's getting bodied off that ball, but somehow maintains possession. Nice play by Connor Uri on that one. Miller fighting. Back to Jake's little brother, Brandon Anthony. Puts a nice pass across to Welsh Perry. He may be Jake's little brother, but rumor has it he's going to be a star. Maybe even brighter than his brother. Horvath with the ball, taps it off to Briscoe. Briscoe and the Reds coming back the other way. Goes for the long ball. Barry's open, tries to put a center. Nice thought there by Barry. 75th minute, still 0-0. Again, Barwick with tons of space up top. Where's the defense of the Reds? This is looking like a great opportunity. Is he going to put it in the box? No, he's going to stand there and do nothing. Come on, Barwick, put the ball in the box. And back come the Reds, playing it out of their own backfield here. Briscoe with lots of room in midfield. Takes it towards the middle. Lawson was making a run. Big ball down deep to Miller. Can Miller control it? Yes, he can. He's going to definitely drop this ball in the box. Puts it in. Got a couple of guys. There's a shot. Bang! In the 79th minute. Oh, no. The flag was up. We got to see this one again. Oh, my goodness. Just off by a hair. Exciting play. Wonderful pass. Just a couple of inches off. And the Reds put one in, but it gets taken off the board on the flag. And the Reds say, I'm going to keep pressing. 81st minute. Khan drops it down to Wood. You can see how happy Wood was, considering all the publicity he's receiving about the position that he's playing. To put that ball in the net would have been absolutely glorious. 
probably would have shut the manager up for a little bit. But nonetheless, here we are, 0-0. Red still continuing to press, moving the ball up the pitch, putting a lot of pressure here on the midfield on United and on United's defense. 85th minute, drop ball into the, the box. Nice play by Hart to punch that ball out. She hasn't seen much action the first two games, but that will change over time. Again, the Reds with the ball, just absolutely dominating possession of late. A couple of minutes left in this game. We don't have many 0-0 games in this league. This might just be one terrible pass by Horvath. Knocks it out of bounds. Back comes United. Nice play there, getting that ball out. Reds pressing again in midfield, trying to force a turnover here, but United strong. Seconds left in this game. Hewitt gets the ball, just gets absolutely flattened in the middle of the field by Horvath. Horvath's a big boy. Gets it out to Vanderlaar, back to Horvath. Here comes Briscoe cutting in. Drops it down to Lawson. Lawson's definitely going to pass that ball in the box. Oh, nice cutoff. And there you go. Our second 0-0 zero, zero game. I think United's got to be pretty happy. Even though it was a 0-0 zero, zero contest, these are two great teams, top teams in the league. It was a rainy game. It was a sloppy game. But United has to be impressed with all the opportunities that they had. This screen's full of crap. They definitely had more than seven shots on goal. Let's go into the statistics here. Liverpool dominated possession late, but definitely the Red Devils had a lot of opportunities in this game. So they've got to be pleased with at least the opportunities. They're going to have to work hard in training this week on some finishing and knocking the ball home. But let's quickly go through the ratings here. Match ratings for Liverpool. Horvath leads it with a 7.3. Lawson and Briscoe, Khan, Bamber, all had solid games. No goals, no assists, shots on target. Briscoe with one. That's it. Passes. Lots of turnovers here in the midfield. Horvath turned the ball over five times on passes. Barry lost the ball a few times on passes. Overall, didn't look that great for the Reds with ball control. Dribbling was okay. Vanderlaar and Wood looked good. Lacassi looked great out of the backfield. Again, I say it every time, ignore these formations that are on these end screens. They're almost always wrong. Cross is completed. Barry. Expect to see Barry and Wood working on their crosses and training. A combined one for nine with their crosses. Tackles, Horvath and Briscoe locked a couple of them in the middle. And Pollock made six big saves. So let's go over here to United. Hewitt played well in the middle. Connor James played well on that right side. Ellis was solid. Miller was solid. Welsh Perry was solid. No goals, no assists. Shot on target. Barwick with the big one early on that could have given them the lead. Took three shots. Hewitt took two shots. Ure took a shot. Passes completed. Solid work. Gibson was 10 for 10. Brandon Anthony was 7 for 7. Uri lost the ball three times. Barwick lost the ball three times. Solid work in the middle, 13 of 13 by the captain. Anthony Gibson and James were perfect. Barwick was great with the dribble. That big body's definitely helping him out. Cross is not many to speak of. Henry dropped one in. Welsh Perry dropped one in. Tackles one. Miller and Barwick locked tackles. Hart finally made a save, but only one on the game. But she does log her first clean sheet in the English Academy. So let's go over here. Let's look at one more time. Tailed two games here. Possession went to Liverpool. Opportunities definitely to United. So we're going to sign off here 0-0. Zero, zero. I think this is going to give you a good inclination of how the league is going to go. Two big powerhouse teams with a lot of potential. They're going to tie it up. 0-0. Zero, zero. Both of these teams are going to be looking 
big time to face each other in league play. Signing off here. Enjoy your evening.